never seen a human before. Oh. And there we go. Now you get to try to catch it. All right, All right so you got it. Nope, that one just ran away. I think that's it. So that's the second uh, second one from the litter that ran down. It's over there someplace I can hear it. There it is. See, see that one? Very, very nervous. So in this litter, these, this is the first time we've taken them out. They're about three weeks old. And you can see that these guys are quite different. Uh, and kitty or even sesame's litter. Oh, darn it, really a pain in the butt when they do this. I mean, look at that guy. This. So do you want to try to catch this one, or, or uh, what's your yeah, problem I with do, that? Yeah, I do, I do. But uh, you do need to give it a, a minute to, like, a, uh -huh. you know, get any idea. Yeah. You know. You see, it runs so fast, it's banging into the walls, which probably makes it even more nervous. It wants to try to climb the walls, but it can't. You see how fast they are. And this is precisely what we're trying to breed out of them. Um, there's no telling how many babies from this litter will actually be at all usable for anything. But it just makes a huge difference who the parents are. You know, as I said before, when you have better parents, then even the worst babies are, are reasonably good. And then you'll have some really outstanding ones. But in a, in a bad litter, the worst babies are, frankly, absolutely unmanageable. And, um, and it's just a, it's just a question of genetics, really. They just, they just don't have good genes. So, oh, yeah, did you see how that, that baby just jumped? Yeah. So, I mean, part of it is, um, what seems to happen is that, um, the, um, the good litters, the babies tend to stay babyish calm and babyish for a longer period of time so babies you know they you know they they're they, they they're sleepy they stay in the nest they don't try to run away or maybe they're playful and curious i mean kitties litter they're 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 active they're playful and curious but they're not this baby is just full of adrenaline i mean she's you know this baby is is desperately trying to escape. Terrified. He's never seen a human before. We don't. There's no reason why it should fear humans, aside from the fact that it's just something new, that you know that that frightens it. I don't know where did the baby go. Oh, is it? Yeah, I can't even find it. They're just so fast. It's really, really yeah. There goes another one. Another one Climbed out of it, ran out of the pocket, and now there you've got two of them running around. I mean, I yeah. I wish I. I don't. I. I mean, there's a limit to how long I want to make this video. Oh, that's good. All right. Well, yeah. It's in the pouch. All right. All right. This one doesn't just jump at me this way. You see, they're reacting different. Yeah. Can you get the other one, or is it just hopeless? Uh, do, you mean running on the floor? Yeah. Where'd it go? Oh, it's on the top of the shelf. Oh, yeah? Hey. Hey, come on. Come on. Well... I think you might be able to get it in a pouch if you try. So we try to get it to go into a, a dark enclosed place where she will hopefully feel okay. safe. Now you need to uh, hold that in probably so she doesn't run away. But yeah, we got her back. All right. Thanks.
a little black one. Is that the little good one? Mm, that's a little... It's a girl. I don't know if it's a good one. Maybe uh -huh. not a little girl. Uh -huh. It was a little boy. But she seems not jumpy at her right now. So. Mm. Yeah. Well, that's good. See? It's not hopeless. I mean, if we thought it was really hopeless, we wouldn't have bred Dusty at all. Um, but she's got at least some good ones here. See, I told her to spread my hands out. I'm yeah. not holding her. She's That's just good. There. She's just calm. She's, uh, she's staying with you. So, you see, this one's, I mean, she's big, like the others, but she's more babyish. The other mm -hmm. ones, you could say they're more mature. Um, in the same way that, uh, like, a, a dog is kind of a babyish version, version of a wolf. You know, it's the same principle. Um, you know, uh, they have more of a juvenile personality. Um, less, hor less hormonal. Less, uh, less, less of a quote-unquote survival instinct. More playful and childish. Yeah, but she's kind of squishing herself down. Yeah. All right. So, I think she's, it's mostly she's doing it out of fear. Mm -hmm. And again, once she's older, we'll have a better sense of that. Yeah, so the digging is, she's trying to escape. That's what I said. Mm -hmm. So squishing themselves down, digging, um, you know, trying to run down. These are all escape uh, behaviors. Oh, right. Uh-oh. She just ran away. Yeah. Uh, there's a boy. All right. And he's relatively okay. He's, he's not... If he oh, wants that's a to, black one. Yeah. Sorry. If he... Uh, it's, it's a black one. It's a black, black boy. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, that one seems relaxed. So you're holding it upside down. Yeah. Oh, is he trying to dig? He's not as nervous as that previous girl. Yeah. Spoke too soon. Yeah, but that girl would just jump. Okay, you stop digging. He's not. Okay, so two. One for sure. This one's a little bit questionable, and then there's other... Ones, two for sure are horrible, and maybe those other two. Yeah, see, that one looks, let's see what he's going to do. Is he going to try to escape? <laughs> yeah, it kind of looks like it. Looks like he's going to run down, maybe. Hey. Hi, little guy. What do you think? I think it's fine. Yeah, okay, that's a pretty long time to stay there. <laughs> okay, you've got potential. Maybe we've got two good ones, two good black ones, we'll see.